Oh baby, the Viper's back in action and we're feeling good, bud. You know we are. We're gonna head out in the sprayer, try and make some money, see what we can get done. It should be a pretty good day. We'll see what happens. Stay tuned, because this is episode nine of Canadian Family Farms. What's going on everyone? Dirty Randy here. And you know what? It's finally ready. Check it out. Oh baby. Oh yeah. All right, let's rip. We should probably bring it back home. Dad's been like, "Are you see how long is it impounded for?" I'll just buy it. I'm like, "No, it just it's under my name. Just let me take care of it." And uh, so I'm just gonna rip her home this morning here. And uh, well, Bob's your uncle, um, but he's actually my father. Ah, uh, <laughs> yeah. All right. Well, we've learned our lesson not to just completely rip through these hills because they'll get you you know to be fair we made it all the way up until these bumps right here so you know I think we did pretty good all right we did pretty good we'll bring her back home and well today I think we're gonna try and make some more money uh, see how that goes there is a few big fields like real big fields that are up for contract to get fertilized so you know, we got a big implement. Why not use it, am I right? Uh, we'll see how it goes. Our corn, wow, looking good. Looking good indeed. I cannot wait for that to get harvested, get back in the fish farming game. And uh, well, we'll see how it goes. Let's just, you know, pop this in here. Uh, this side, I think, right? Wonderful. All right, cool guy slide across the hood into the car. That's what we did, and you can't prove otherwise. It just happened so fast. All right, back it up. Oh, all right, all right, all right. We're good. We're good. All right. Looking good. He'll never know. He never has to know. Never. Bye, car. All right, you know what? We are going to open this up, though, because now we're kind of... Oh, here without a vehicle. Um, let's get this opened up. And, uh, well, let's just hop on a little something to get back over through the farm, you know. It makes sense. All right, it's open enough. Let's boogie. Oh, my. Yeah, that's got some get up and go. Okay, she do. She do be. She do be do. Scooby do. All right. Um, in through here. What are we looking at? Uh, something like this. Well, you know what, actually? We're going to be doing some big fields. We're going to need some help with it. So, we know that guy's good to go. Uh, it's just a matter of getting her there. So, I don't know why we came all the way down here. We weren't using our schnoggin. Um, I don't know if we're going to need the ATV. Because I know we got some, uh, some liquid support on the tank uh, of... Our truck over here so you know what we might be whoa using this today do we bring the ATV just in case uh, I mean I guess it couldn't hurt and you know what look at this look at that look at that badge Elk Mountain Ranch that's right we're throwing it back just a wee bit that's the nice thing my granddad my pops not my granddad but my pops you know he came down he saw our operation. He got inspired. So this is uh, this is working his working truck. He threw on a decal. I appreciate that. You know, reminds me not of home, but uh, oh, of our ranch that uh, you know I was so proud to get done. Um, all right, you know we're gonna have to fandangle with the ramps, but we can do it. All right. Well, I mean, ATV's on. I don't know how long it'll stay there. It's not strapped on. And frankly, I don't know if we're going to need it, but I don't give a darn. We're going to try it anyways, and there we go. Look at this big beast. Try not to run into the field. Oh, that's tight, brother. Looking good. Yeah, we're going to need uh, some extra fertilizer for sure uh, if we're doing some big fields. So, does not hurt to break this big boy out. 
Gotta make this little fancy turn. This is gonna be a tight toit like a twiga. Oh nailed it. Crushed it. You love to see it. We just gotta get topped up here. Um I think if we go this direction, it might be easiest. This is always odd with this bump, but we can do it. And now we go back over it again. The ATV is doing surprisingly well on the back. All right, that's filling up. We're gonna go grab the big sprayer and, uh, you know, I don't know, is it worth putting on a truck to move around? Uh, those fields are just kind of across the way. But, um, I don't know. I think we can probably just drive this guy there. It's going to be more hassle than it's worth getting everything loaded up, getting those trailers out, getting them strapped down when uh, we could really just throw on the hazard lights, the beacons, and, uh, well, people can just watch out. All right, we got the big unit out, and uh, we're getting just transferred over, everything topped up that way. We should be really good to go. Gosh, this truck is just looking fantastic. It sounds great. Oh, hey, I didn't notice that. Engraved in the bumper an email. Dad, make him feel proud. Bring a tear to my eye. All right, we are fully loaded up now. So I think we can probably set off. Uh, we should maybe accept a contract first RQ just to make sure we know where we're going uh, as well. Oh, we have... Field 25 and 22. Both worth a fair bit of money. Do we tackle the smaller one first? The potatoes? I think we do that. You know, we were talking about it the other day. Let's let's do that. And uh, then we can always see how it goes. And if it goes well, we can always tackle a bigger one. But for now, let's just take it. We're not going to borrow the items. We're just going to take it. Uh, field 25. It's going to be... A little bit of a trip to get there, but that's fine. And uh, I believe we could always get some help getting the uh, the support vehicle brought over. I don't think that'll be a huge, huge deal. I'm sure, you know, one of my brothers or, I don't know, dad, something like that, has the time to just bring it over. They don't have to do anything else. Just drive it there. It's the least they could do. All right, this is where it gets a little bit hairy. Public roads. Okay. No one's coming that way. I don't see... Any oh, okay. This guy's coming. Uh. Okay. You go. Alright, now we go. Wonderful. Okay. We gotta hug the side. Wonderful. Around the sign. Hug the grass. Alright, there we go. Hey, is that our truck in the rear view? Look at that. I swear. Look at that. He's doing it! I wonder, if is he going to wait for us, I wonder? Or is he just going to go? Hey! Alright, we're going to follow him. Let's do it. ATV's on the back. Looking good. Who knows, maybe they'll hang out. They'll probably just drive around for funsies, but way she goes. Okay. We got to keep it tight to the bush. Red van. Terrifying, because that one's a bit taller. It's a van, and I suppose we can just follow the support vehicle. You know, you really should have his blinkers on thing. Wide load ahead, or not ahead, behind, coming, wide load. Or something of that nature. Alright, don't hit the mailbox. We're good. Don't hit the scale. Looks like the truck is... twinning. Alright, alright, alright. This is the field we're going to be attacking. So I suppose we don't need to follow him all the way down the road there. We could just go into the field now. I'm going to hit this mailbox. We're good. We're polite. All right. Dip into here. Okay. Just, but we nailed it. Fantastic. And look at that. We got a full tank ready to rock to reload us 
whenever. Thanks, Dad. All right. Well, we've made it. Let's uh, let's unfold this. What is going to be the best way to go about? Oh my gosh! Don't hit the truck. <laughs> about getting this done, I wonder. Let's widen those wheels. Let's lower this down too, because we got some taters. They're not too tall. Uh, hmm. I don't know. I guess maybe we can use the truck as a bit of a marker. Otherwise. I think we can probably just start getting her done the best we can. Um, we'll go like this, and then we'll straighten out for the other way. Oh, perfect. Did not hit the post. Nailed it. So, there we go. I've been, I've been talking lots, getting everything loaded up. Um, oh, we could go over a tad bit more. We'll get used to it. We don't want to leave any room though so we'll find a little trench we'll stick in it the best we can and uh, we'll get her done this is the game plan we're gonna be making a fair bit of money um, from this if we can get her done so that being said let's try our best if we can do it and we still have uh, some stuff left over we can keep on rolling I suppose the support vehicle can always go back and uh, top up and we can just stay out and keep rolling so That'll be ideal if we do get low. We'll try and keep an eye on it. Should be a good day. All right, well, of course we run out on what looked to be the very last pass. I don't know. I was just eyeballing it the whole time. Um, I don't got any fancy GPS or anything like that, so I'm just out here doing my best. And, uh, well, you know, the last little strip, we run out. So we'll have to get these hoses hooked up, refilled, and uh, we should be good to go. All right, let's get turned around. We can go do the last little bit here. And then, uh, well, take a peek at the map, see how we did. Um, so I'm curious to know. Like I said, I was just eyeballing it, getting her done. And, you know, usually there's some touch-up needing to be done. But I think usually we, uh, you know, we, we try our best. I don't know. Well, we'll see. Like I said, one last little strip. Of course, that's where we run out. But now we're all full once again to get it done. Uh, oh, gosh, where were we? I can't see my tracks. Something here. Uh, maybe a little bit further over. Alright, we were about here, it looks like. So we're going to keep going. And then that should be that. This is a... Honestly, I enjoy doing this field. It's a big field. Real big field. Big potato field. But these ridges kind of just keep you in line there. So that is nice. Um, although we were kind of driving on top of a lot of them going across them but it's fine we did fine um let's have a peek how we did on uh, the map boom get rid of stones look at that one little strip right there but you know what it's so tiny i don't think it's going to make that much of a difference you know a handful of potatoes my bad i will say that's a job well done um which is awesome and we know we could do pretty much this entire field with almost one tank. We just filled up our tank, so 22. That's on the bucket list as well. That's a. This is, like I said, I think this is honestly the biggest field we have in, uh, in town here. So that's the most money we're going to get for a fertilizing job. 
you know, if there's ever a time, I think this is, uh, this is it. So let's see. Fertilizing completed. Let's collect that 24. That's more money than we've had right there. That is fantastic. And another 35. If we can do this, you know we're going to try and do it. Uh, hold on. Where is 40? Is that close? Uh, kind of. Just across the tracks. We could hop over. Do 40 really quick as well. Um, doesn't hurt. I don't know what's in that field. Something's growing, but we're literally right here. The truck's on the same road. Let's do it. 40. I'll take it. And then uh, after that, we'll attack this one. We're going to accept it. I'm not going to forget about it. We're taking it. We're going to do it. So there we go. We probably will have to get this guy folded up, but our road is just over there. Should be a pretty good one. <laughs> Making... Mooney, um, you know, definitely our biggest income day yet, and we could use it because these fields are not cheap to purchase, that is for sure. So, if we want to get more land, you know, it really is an investment and you got to work for it. So, sometimes things get a little repetitive, but uh, it's you know, they're not always our fields. Once we have more land, you know, it's not like those jobs are going to go away, it's just we got to do them for ourselves on our own time, and of course, then they're unpaid as well. So Oh, nice little bridge. Uh, well, that's fancy. All right, this is uh, the field in question. So this uh, should be should be doable. Should be doable. It had withered weeds, so we know that checks out. We can do a little of that, a little bit of that. And a little bit of this. Get that good stuff going. Get it flowing. And, uh, well, hopefully get another $10,000. Um, well, this does actually not extend all the way over. I wasn't sure if this field was a part of it or not, but it looks like it is not. So that definitely helps us. Makes our job that much easier. And it feels like we only got to do two-thirds of a field now. I was prepared for this whole sector to get done. But now we're looking good. We can get this one done. And after that uh, other big field we just did, you know, this one should feel pretty easy-peasy. Um, but, I mean, it's definitely, you know, it, it takes some focus, takes some work. You know, keeping it straight, keeping it lined up, eyeballing it. It's, uh, it's not easy. It takes some focus, and it is draining as much as it's like, well, I'm just driving, you know. It's focus driving. Oh my God, we're gonna hit the trees. It's not not a straight field. That's okay with me. We like the challenge. Let's get her going. Let's do it, bud. Lobby, is that is that it already? Are we already done? Pretty much just this. You know, like I said, it was gonna go by quick compared to that other field. I only feel like I just caught my breath and just finished speaking. Um, you know, somehow feel like we didn't do a great job either, but let's check it out real quick. Gee, that's not bad. One tiny little triangle and that little piece right there, but it is completed. We can collect the money. And we're going to do just that. Thanks for the $10,000, my friend. And, uh, well, time for the big one. 55.41 acres. By God. That's, it's going to be a job. It's going to be a job for sure. Um, we probably should go top up our tank. Uh, now it feels a little bit more worth it, considering we just only topped up when we finished that last field. So now it'll be worth it to fill up once again and once that is done we can probably send the truck off to go get reef well uh, hey a lovely train sorry i love trains choo 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 look at that ah uh, yeah buddy that reminds me of home i'll tell you what i mean we are home you love to see it you love to see it 
All right, we can get pulled up uh, here. And uh, yeah, as I was saying before I got uh, distracted by the train, you know, I'm not sure if we're going to have to refill this once again or not, you know. Um, it. Are we going to need to fertilize much more with this guy? Um, I'm not really sure. All right. We're heading off. We're topped up now. And there's still 20... 20% left in there, which is about half a tank for us. So we know we're going to have to, oh my gosh, refill uh, at some point. But is another half a tank going to be enough to get it done? I'm hoping so. I'm hoping so. You know, um, if it doesn't, I mean, it's not the end of the world. But I really hope it is enough. We are closer to the farm, so we could always just go get some more. But again, that's going to take some time. It's already about 3 o'clock in the afternoon here. So, you know, by the time we get done this field, if we have to go back home, you know, it's going to be cutting her close. But I think we'll be just fine. Uh, the truck should be following along to some extent, making his way. Uh, I don't know. Uh, oh, this is not quite the field we're after. My bad, my bad. Sorry, traffic. The next one. The next one. This is some lovely water right there. And it's pretty much where we're pulling into. I believe there's field access. Yeah, right here. Perfect. Nice. Okay. Um, looking good. Oh, oh, oh. There's the truck. Pulling in hot. Lovely. All right, well. Jeez, yeah. you love to see it. Okay. Oh my god. <laughs> what is he doing? That's not. I thought you were just going to park beside the field, not on the field. This guy's a crazy guy. Maybe he's just turning around. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know what he's doing. But hey, you ask man to do a job, he's doing the job. Okay, I'm glad he's here. We got that field support. Oh, and look at that. He's parked up. Wonderful. All right, we're about, uh, well, a good amount done the headland now. I was going to say halfway done, but that's not true at all. Uh, we just finished up the headland, and we got refilled back to 90%. And, uh, well, we sent them back off to go possibly refill, because I don't know if we're going to have enough to get her done. We got 90%, but still, it's, it's a big job. So uh, let's lower this back down. Not all the way, but a good amount. And again eyeballing it best we can so let's uh, let's do it we've done pretty okay in our other ones so far so you know hopefully the same trend keeps up and we do pretty okay on this one uh, it is pretty wonky field shape but that's kind of nice in getting the headland area done which means we can kind of just you know we might waste a little bit doing that but uh, you know I think will be pretty time efficient uh, by just keeping our rolling and not having to worry about the edges too much now and uh, yeah it should be pretty good um, yeah because even for like this part coming up here you know we're done out to the edge so that is nice we don't have to deal with that kind of awkwardness of this next one um, but yeah, we'll see how it goes. I don't know. It'll be kind of an interesting one. Definitely my most challenging field yet. So we'll see how it goes. Uh, like I said, Headland is pretty much done there. So if we go do this part of the field 
and the headland is done up here, we should hopefully be able to turn around nicely. And, uh, well, minimal. I was going to say overlap, but we want overlap. A little bit, but mistakes. You know what I'm saying. All right, well, I think we did it. Moment of truth. Uh, just finish up this last little bit or so, I think. And let's check out how we did. Uh, you know, it's exciting. Wow, we did horrible. That is not even, my God. Okay, yeah, we're gonna need some more some more fertilizer out here because we just, yeah, we vastly overestimated our abilities. All right, well, if we weren't so bad at this, we'd be fine. But uh, we only got like 5% left in the tank. All right, well, we're empty. Uh, there's the support vehicle. So, I guess we'll just meet him over there. And then we gotta finish this job up, so uh, it is what it is. I mean, at least there's still a little bit of daylight left, but I mean, the sun's coming down for show, and I'd love to get wrapped up, but I mean, hey, uh, money don't come easy, you know what I mean? You gotta earn it, so fair enough. Oh, okay. I just need it hot, I need it quick. If you could stop moving, sir. All right, well, thank you for the support. They're off, and daylight is pretty much gone, so let's try and spang this out. Just a little bit here, and a little right here. Just a wee little strip right here. Gosh, that's a gorgeous evening. It really is. Uh, that sunset, the moon, mm, you love to see it, my friends. You, you do, you love to see it. Little strippy right here. All right, there we go. That should be it. Um, should be good to go now after that. Wow, that actually is uh, no joking. It's, it's a really nice evening. Whoa, whoa, whoa! Was there? We're good. We're good. We just gotta get her home and get paid. Let's get paid. Field twenty-two, fertilizing complete. Thirty-five thousand five hundred and forty-three dollars. Yes, please. Thank you very much. Amazing. Look at that. We even cleaned it up. We didn't just say we were going to do it. We did it. We cleaned it up. We got it done. You love to see it. All right. We got the beacons on. We got the hazards flashing. We just need to get off the road. Oh, sorry. We just took out the mailbox. I'm pretty sure he just fixed that, too. Oops. To the farm. It's been a good day now. All right. There we go. That's been our longest day yet. It's like 9.30 right now. But we have $91,000 in the bank account. That is amazing. That's fantastic. Yeah, you love to see it. You really do. Um, the truck is not there. Where did we park our truck today? Right. We did not. We, we brought the Viper back. So we didn't even bring our truck. Uh, I guess that's the way she goes. We'll bring this guy back. Did a great job for us today, honestly. Uh, no complaints there. And you know what? The ATV even stayed in place. So that is great. Let's swing wide here. Something like so. And that can hang out right there. Look at that. That's pretty saucy, my friends. Alright, well, you know what? We're going to go sneak in some leftovers because I know mom and dad are asleep by now. And uh, we're pretty hungry, so that's going to have to be it for today's episode. I hope you enjoyed it. We got money in the bank account now. You'll love to see it. So, hey, thank you so much for watching. And, uh, well, we'll see you in the next one, all right? Ooh, secret room. Bye-bye. Uh,